Hey guys, Michael Stillwell here from Stillwell Pianos in Mesa, Arizona, and you just listened to a Weinbach piano. So if you don't know what Weinbach is, uh, you're normal. Most people don't know what Weinbach is. <laughs> Weinbach is the second tier for a brand called Petrov, which are handmade pianos from the Czech Republic. Um, now a Petrov of this size, this is a five foot five, a Petrov of this size MSRP would probably be closer to like maybe $35,000. Weinbach was their second tier down, just like Steinway has tiers. Steinway has Steinway Boston Ethics, um, so that these ones are a little bit cheaper than the Steinway. Petrov does the same thing, so they have um, Petrov and then Weinbach is below that. Um, and then they also have another one below that as well, but Weinbach is their kind of second tier one. Now this one was made in Asia and uh, Weinbach or Petrov had a big design, a part in the design process of this piano. Uh, but they did this to make this a little bit more budget friendly. Now we bought this piano locally here in Arizona from a local family that really did not use it very much. And we got it in, we buffed all the surface scratches out of it, had all that cleaned up, same with the hardware. There's no cracks in the soundboard bridge or pin block. This thing is fully intact. It's a very, very young piano. We can't tell exactly the age of it, but we know it's at least uh, no older than 2010. So it's a very, very young piano. Usually we don't see baby grands um, on the used market till they're about 25, 20 years old. Um, so this is a pretty young one and it's in really, really good shape. And if you, as you just heard, the scale design is extremely pure. That's what Petrov was always known for um, and it definitely conveyed into this Weinbach. It's a very, very clean, pure scale design. It has a little bit more of a brighter sound, just like a Yamaha or Kawai. The action, the down weight on the action is very light, just like Yamaha and Kawai as well. So if you're looking for that kind of um, Japanese feel and sound, uh, but you want to have a bring the price down a little bit, this is a great, great option. And at five foot five, that's kind of a weird size for pianos. Usually we stop at like five foot two, five foot three for Yamaha, and then we jump all the way to the parlor size, which starts at five foot eight. Um, so five foot five is kind of right there in the middle. It's really nice. So guys, if you have any questions about this particular piano or any other piano on our website, always feel free to shoot me an email at michael at stillwellpianos.com. Thanks for watching, guys.